hey guys welcome back to my channel so i wanted to come on and share with you this is another design team package from a shop on aliexpress called dimple girl store um she had, they had some really cute um some really cute dyes and they wanted me to um pick some dyes to um uh, to work with and i want to show you guys what i picked out and um I will be doing some project shares as soon as I can. Okay, so the first one, um, this is this cute little witch with her broom. And it looks like she's wearing like striped um, leggings. Super cute. So she's um, right at two inches, two ish inches wide. Uh, but she is four and a half inches tall. That's gonna be fun. And then let's see, this one I got is a um a haunted house. So you've got their your base house, you know, your house um base piece, and then, then your top piece, and then your columns for your front porch, windows, um, like broken um shutter pieces different things like that and so you've got different window options too so you've got these those um those two which would probably be inside the shutters and then you've got these and like i said the columns for the porch um or columns going up you know to the top instead of um just short ones so yeah um this is gonna be hard to measure without it being put together, but I can tell you the base of the house is two and a quarter. This is before embellishing the house by three, two and a quarter by three. So that's a good little size. And then the next one, um, this is actually a cake. Um, it's like a, uh, what do you call the cake? It's like the, Topsy turvy, where they're one, you know, part sitting this way, and then the next one sitting this way, and you know, um, so this is the cake stand right here. Swirls, and then let's see, you've got there's one of your cakes. Um, that'd probably be the bottom layer. So there's that one. You can make polka dots. There's another one there. And then you've got another one here with icing dripping down. And then there's your layering piece for your icing. And then you've got different little things to um, embellish and decorate your cake with. Some spider webs, pumpkins. Um, I believe that is pumpkin faces. And this looks like a little hat for him to wear. And then you got a bat. So, yeah, that one's going to be pretty fun to play with. Super cute. Sorry about that glare. Okay, and the next one, oh my goodness, this is so stinking cute. So, this is, this reminds me of Marie. Um, I'm sure if you know of Aristocats. Look at the little cat here. She's so cute. And then she's got her skirt pieces. Um. And it is only her upper body because the skirt is covering her booty. <laughs> so you're going to have her skirt, you know, here, the layers. Um, and then her tail's going to be sticking out. It looks like a layering piece. And then you've got, like, for her eyes, a rose in her hair, um, her ears, a hat, and then little um, pieces for the hat as well. Super cute. Alright, the next one is, let's see, just a second. Okay, so um, I should have done the pictures to put them in the corner of the video like I did on uh, one of my previous ones. Um, but it is here on my phone and I wanted to go ahead and show you guys. Let's see. Um... Dimple Girl store. So that is the witch. Yeah, that's the witch one that I showed you here. Let's see. Um, 
Oh, here's the, uh, the one that reminds me of Marie. This one. This is how she looks. Isn't that super stinking cute? She is just adorable. Not sure if that's focusing. But isn't she so cute? Okay, so the rose is on her collar. The bat hanging from the hat. And then her tail poking out here. Okay, so that is super adorable. And then the, oh, the cake one, the cake stand. This one here. Um, so, okay, so that was the bottom piece. And then the next one is the polka dots. And the web goes on the plain one. Okay, so, all right, here is... Okay, there we go. So, that's what we have here. Those are your polka dots. And then those are your layering pieces for your polka dots. Okay, the spider web goes on that plain one there. And then the pumpkin. Okay, that's not a witch. That's um, a witch. I thought it was a witch hat. Um, but that is green top there with the flame and then that small piece right there under my finger is the um, layering piece for the flame and the wings as you see go down here the bottom and um, the round and oval the oval yeah ovalish looking ones and these right here are layering pieces for the bottom there so that's gonna be fun to play with um, what was the other one? Oh, the haunted house so uh, that was this one here so okay Okay, so that tall piece are the steps. The pumpkin sits there. Um, now, while those could be broken shutter pieces, it looks like those are over the door. Like, the door is um, boarded shut. And the window up there. So, you do use all of the windows, it looks like. And um, those little pieces are the shutters. Like, one's falling off there. Awesome. Fun, fun, fun. And uh, the next one um, was this one. You can see it's a little, a critter with some big eyeballs. So let me, um, let me grab that one right quick. Which one is that? Okay, here she is. She. <laughs> She's cute though, is why I said she. So, okay, here it is. So she's like a she's like a little um a little cutesy bat. Yeah, she's a bat. We have a little pumpkin sitting next to her, and there's all the layering pieces for the pumpkin, layering pieces for her eyes, um, oh layering pieces for the pumpkin's face as well, and then her little hat, and you got all the roses here um to embellish her hat. And then oh you've got the funky little fuzzy spider that it hangs from her hat. That is so cute. That little weird looking piece <laughs> is the body um, of the bat. So cute. That is so adorable. Little leaf pieces. I love it. So stinking cute. That's going to be so fun to play with. What is that? Uh, it looks like maybe there was a bow sticking. There's a bow back there. Maybe. Sticking out behind her hat. I don't know. We'll see when I start to put it together. So, there's that one. And then the next one here are little, um, not soldiers. Um, I think it does say soldier, but 
what do you call them? The little, um, they remind me of Christmas, but they can be done in any color. These little guys. Yeah. So you get all the pieces for, um, you know, their little feet. What is that? Okay. Right. Anyway, um, for their feet, you know, face, hands, outfits, um, nutcracker. That's what I call them, nutcrackers. So, yeah. Anyway, um, so they can all have their different hats and different faces. So, yeah. There's those guys. And then our next one is... Is it that girl? Okay. Um, it's a little girl in a dress with her cute little... Um, like ponytail, pigtails, and her big old hat. And you can see there's layering pieces for the eyes. Um, she's got a little hand. Little apron that goes on her dress. So, here she is. She's got, um, okay, those little pieces there are her are her little boots super adorable little ruffles at the bottom of her dress the apron the hands super cute that is adorable big old cute eyes and of course her hair can be any color and then you've got a layering piece for her hat as well this one's gonna be so fun to put together they're all gonna be so fun to put together i can't wait <laughs> and then the next one is like a Frankenstein. Um, it, they call it a, on the description, they call it a steampunk three-dimensional robot boy. <laughs> um, here he is with his, his big old head, big old eyes, and his stitch marks. And then you've got the hair piece for the top, the layering part for stitches, um, his shorts, more layering pieces for eyes, and then you've got his little... Um, See over here, he's got his clothes and his pants are ripped. So you've got little um, pieces to layer for stitching. Um, and I love when there's little stitching details on stuff because it puts the embossing marks there. But I also like to go in uh, by hand with needle and thread and also put real stitches in it. And it just gives it, you know, that little bit more... Um, texture dimension so here he is of course he can be any color they've got him blue on here um i can see doing him in a like a pastel green maybe of course he can be in any color and it can go with any um pastel halloween or you know your basic colors or whatever you want him to look like really yep so um, okay, and we're down to the last couple. So, this last one here is a little, um, a little house, and it's a little, um, 3D gingerbread house. Let's see. Um, well, it doesn't have to be 3D, um, but it can be. You can do it flat, obviously, without using the extra tabs, um, and just use, you know, the front, and that could be like a tag, you know, using just that piece, or you can make it like a small, um, it'd be very small, because that would be the width of it, um, a small little, um, box for treats, and it does come with layering pieces here. So this one is the base of the box, giving you all your windows and your details and your score marks where you need to fold your tabs. And then here are your um, snow pieces for embellishing. Um, you've got the snow that goes up and around the shape of the house and then one for the doorway, a little wreath for the doorway, a little bow for the wreath there. And, I mean, you could always use it without the snow, and it'd be a different theme. Um, but here is the picture. Let's see if you can see that. 
yeah so the door um actually opens as you can see here it's got a, a score mark to fold it but it cuts the other side so the door will actually open super cute and um let's see i'm not sure what this piece is for though maybe it could be snowballs it could be snowballs stacked up um they use it okay that's an example on a card hmm. we'll just have to see what i come up with yep. so um oh i had ordered a um one that was a deer um and i i'm thinking they were out of stock so they sent me a different one um which is fine but I really did want the um, the original one. Um, this is the one that I had ordered. Here. More like a cutesy, I don't know, you know, profile of a deer. Um, the front view of a deer. Um, so they sent me this one in place of it. And it does have a deer. And it's like a snow scene. You can layer this one up. Um, in different ways, and you've got, you know, snow or ice coming down, trees. So, that's really cute. And I don't have a picture for that one, because like I said, the other one was out of stock. Um, and they sent this in place of it. Yeah, so I don't, I'm not seeing a picture here for that one. Um, I am pretty positive it's in the store. Um, so when I link um, these dies in the description box, I will link um, this one instead of the one that was out of stock. Um, or I can list both in case you're interested in the other one and maybe it's in stock now. So, yeah. And then um, they also included a freebie. Um, it's this little giveaway sticker and it's like this little silhouette of a lady. Big fancy hat here. And then she's got like these flower silhouette pieces like in, made into her dress and body. And, um, I think I did find this one on the store. Um, I don't have it pulled up right now, but I can link this one as well for anybody who, uh, might be interested. And, um, yeah, so the link will be down there for you. And so you guys, this store, so this is, um, this is our store on AliExpress. Uh, Dimple Girl Store. Let's look at, um, see, there's the few that I had just looked at to show you guys. Um, but there's all kinds of different ones. All kinds. That's a different kind of haunted house there. That's adorable. Little witch shoes on the side and candies. Big, uh, witch's hat. On top there um, this is under new arrivals so I think so I didn't see this one available when I picked um, the dies that I was trying out but there's so many cute things on here look at these adorable little girls um, they're done well she's done in neon colors but of course you can do it in any color you want We've got these cute little um, they remind me of the little girls from uh, the little golden books. Yeah. I guess that's, what is that, Little Bo Peep? And that one's like, no, that's Little Bo Peep. And she's, I don't know who she is. But yeah, that's what they look like. Um, other Halloween ones in here. Some uh, different Christmas ones. Some that are just cute. Check those out. So, yeah. Okay. So, that is it um, for my design team package from this shop. Again, it is called Dimple Girl Store. I will have uh, the main shop linked in the description for you guys to go check it out, as well as the links to the items here that I'm showing you. And that's it for this video. I hope you guys will go check out um, her store. 
um, take a look around and see what you might like for yourself. And um, yeah, that's it for now. I will be back as soon as I can with some project shares and show you guys what I came up with for these dies. Um, probably some embellishments. So yeah, I will see you guys on the next crafty video. Bye-bye.